An appeal court in Mombasa has nullified the election of Lamu Senator Anwar Loitiptip of Jubilee. A three-judge bench ruled that the election was marred with irregularities and directed the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission to hold fresh elections in Lamu. While Senator Loitiptip heads to the Supreme Court, it was celebration for Marakwet East MP Kangogo Bowen, Turkana Women Representative Joyce Emanikor, and Turkana East MP Mohammed. Lokiru, whose elections were upheld. The Court of Appeal in Lamu has nullified the election of the Senator Anwar Loy Tip Tip. In overturning a decision of the High Court, the Court of Appeal ordered IEBC to conduct a fresh election. Wiper Democratic candidate Hassan Albay had challenged Loy Tip Tip's election, citing massive irregularities relating to vote counting and verification. The Jubilee Senator, whose election had been upheld by the High Court, has vowed to move to the Supreme Court. <laughs> kuru judiciary maneke mara nyingi watu wailaumu wa, wa lakini hapa judiciary Mungu ndo anajua wamefanya kazi yao sawa sawa bila kusukumwa Marakwet East MP Kangogo Bowen was validly elected. In Eldoret, Court of Appeal judges Irastes Githinji, Fatma Sijale and Anna Okwengu ruled that the petitioner, Sami Kipkeo Kemboi, failed to adduce enough evidence that there were massive irregularities in Bowen's election victory. Bowen had taken the matter to the Court of Appeal after Kipkeo had successfully convinced the High Court that there were irregularities in some polling stations, casting doubt on the final numbers. Addressing his supporters immediately after ruling the MP weighed in on the conversation about corruption in the country. We are supporting the president and the deputy president in the fight against the corruption. Yes. We support because these are the masses, these are people who are suffering because of corruption in this country. So we are saying we are ready for lifestyle audit. Chukana East MP Mohamed Lokiru's election was also upheld. Former MP Nicolas Ngikor, who came second in the August 8th general election, had sought nullification of Lokiru's win, citing massive irregularities. Tukana Women Representative Joyce Emanikor has also been given mandate to continue serving in her position after the Court of Appeal dismissed an election petition over the seat filed by Pauline Lokuruka. Three judges of appeal who ruled the matter noted that the petitioner failed to substantiate claims of massive irregularities in the election. Melmiendo, NTV.